Hi everyone, my name is Antonio Pyron and here I am with one of the biggest innovations in guitar gear in the world in 2017. It's a product by AMT Electronics which is called Bungear CP100FX. And today I'm going to make a short review of this amazing piece of gear. CP100FX is very unique stereo processor with, to my opinion, everything what any guitar player may need in his live performance studio recordings or anywhere. It has so many things and so many controls for every single effect in Pangea. I couldn't even imagine until I finally got it personally, let's take delay. You can make almost any sort of any type of delay with only one delay type in Pangea because it has so many controls and so many adjustments for it, just tons of them and the same thing with every single effect in Pangea. It's not only a professional guitar fix processor, it is also incredible IR cabinet simulator that allows you to use up to two cabinets at the same time in stereo mode. And plus, as you know, your full and complete guitar tone is not only your preamp and cabinet, that is also critically important to have a power amp in your chain because power amp gives you that fullness, that MIDI tone guitar that you want. And that is why Pangea has eight power amp simulations inside and it has the choice of different type of tubes that you want so let's look at Pangea a little closer what we have in it you got input for your guitar or output from your preamp you got through output it's like clink for your guitar and your amp on stage you've got two XLRs for your PA or mixer stereo output for using white cable if you use mono jack, you get mono signal, it's all simple. Ground lift, power, MIDI in, MIDI out, to control Pangea from other MIDI device, or you can control other MIDI device with the knobs on Pangea. And expressional pedal. Also, you've got phone's output, for those who like to practice in the headphones. Aux in, USB, to update the software of Pangea with your computer. SPDIF output, and slot for your SD card where you have your impulses. You can load your own impulses here if, if you want or buy official AMT impulses, they're awesome and I will use them in this test. You can find much more information in the official man manual of Pangea and SS11 of course, but it is not the reason why we're here and we're here to test it and try to make one experiment that I really, really want to try now. So. The idea of this review is pretty unique. I don't want to show you all the effects that Pangea has as an effects processor. I want to try to copy the sound of very famous and recognizable musicians with only my Pangea CP100 fix and my guitar preamp SS11A. This is my favorite guitar tube preamp that I use personally because it's this is my preamp. I tried tons of small guitar preamps from Mr. Boogie, Hugis Kettner, but none of them can compare to SS11A in its tube tone and the quality that it gives you. And that is why I chose this one for this test. And now we're gonna take different artists and start our test. For the first test, I think that would be really cool to take Brian May from Queen and his solo from the song called Bohemian Rhapsody. We'll use Vox cabinet in it and, and also my guitar preamp SS11A. So let's do it. So, that's what we've got with Brian May sound. And the next artist will be David Gilmore from Pink Floyd and the song called Shine a New Crazy Diamond. David has really awesome, clean, Stratocaster sound. And my Gary Grammer will be awesome at that. So, let's try it.
And now, it's time to make our review a little more heavier. And we're gonna play Metallica's Hardwired from their latest album. James Hetfield's sound is very aggressive and very meaty. Well, I don't have active pickups and ESP guitars, but let's see what you can say about this. Let's try it. And that was it. Actually, what can I say about it? This is really amazing guitar processor and it's and it, so small, look at it. it. It's just so small, you can literally put it in your pocket and have absolutely any sound, any tone. You have a tuner, you can control other MIDI devices with it. And that, as we just understood, having only these two pedals, you can make almost any sound that you want. That was me, Anton Pyrin. Like and subscribe to this channel to see lots of really, really interesting videos. Hope to see you soon. Play rock and roll. Goodbye.